Hey, so I figured out what I want to learn today. I want to make one of those action paintings, like a Jackson Pollock style, like a splatty boy, like a drippy, a drippy dude, like a, I don't know anything about Jackson Pollock, except he's a very talented fish, but I did find a couple of videos about how to do these action paintings, and let's do it. Let's, let's learn a thing. Let's learn a thing together. I'm sitting on a shower curtain that I have the dollar tree because I didn't want to get paint all over the floor because the canvas is supposed to be on the floor and not on the easel and the reason for that is that you want to have fluid movement because you want the paint to I don't know. They, they said they said put it on the floor. I put it on the floor. I'm just doing what the art people tell me to do. You're not even supposed to use any kind of brush. Um, they said to use paint sticks, but I didn't have any, so I just got these rulers, and and then you dip it in the paint, and then you fling it. You fling the paint. You splatter it. I'm in. <laughs> The paint is supposed to be dripped, splattered, dropped, anything as long as you're not pushing it onto the canvas with a brush or um, some kind of tool. It, it's not supposed to be pushed or, or smeared. The paint is supposed to be dropped um, on the canvas. And that's why it's called an action painting. Apparently, because you're, you can see the movement. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> Thank you.